feels like we're regressing as a society. No, we are. Like, okay, and I can see this just in gaming. Like, I can just use gaming as an example. It's not even, like, controversial. But the fact that nowadays you have people who are, like, I wouldn't say good at games, folks who are passionate for games, like, voicing their thoughts and, like, trying to make a game better. And anytime you say anything that doesn't go along with the, the social norm, that's a social norm for no no reason, you're labeled, like, all these things. Bad at the game, L takes, skill issue, like, every phrase under the book. Because no one actually thinks about this stuff. Like, in my case, I'm trying to make Apex more fun for pubs. Make it to where people don't leave the game all the time. There's actually more action going on, more battling a battle royale. And all people say is, um, <clears throat> it's a battle royale, bro. You're lucky to have a respawn system. But that makes no fucking sense. Like, every new BR has a respawn system. And battle royales are lucky to have one. If you didn't, people would get bored and leave. Like, no one's gonna sit there and spectate for fucking 15 minutes. Everyone can collectively agree that that shit sucks. I feel like, I don't know. There's nobody who's just, like, playing with their friend and is like, you know what? I just wanted to actually watch my friend play for 15 minutes. And if you wanted to, you could just be like, yo, just don't re don't respond me. Like, you could always have the option to respond them, but just say, hey, don't. I'm gonna go, like, BRB and do some stuff. You play. Like, that works yeah. out perfectly, too. So, it it's just a win-win, like, no matter what. Like, if you... Focus on the folks who want to get kills, that like the majority of people who leave games because they, you know, you die early, you can't get kills. They leave because of that reason. More respawns, more kills to be gotten. That problem is somewhat solved. Uh, people who just want to win the game. Let's say like you're trying to win the game, you get like fucked on in some way. You have an extra chance to come back. Or you can like not have to play for banners and fucking just basically run to your death or some shit. And people will like use an example of, oh, well, we can't just copy Warzone. The fuck you mean we can't just copy Warzone? Because what, what do you think a replicator Warzone, is? Warzone and Overwatch took pings from Overwatch or took pings from Apex. Yeah. And like even even past that, like Apex already took something from Warzone. The replicator station is buyback. It, it's a buy station. Warzone has buy stations. You use money to buy stuff. Replicators in Apex use, what is it? Juice to buy stuff. Like, That's and fair. Warzone has jump towers from Apex. It's, people are just, like, they're just so, like, caveman in their thoughts with this stuff. Oh, you can't, you can't take these ideas. Like, they're both battle royales to begin with. They're already in the same genre. They're already closely related. You can't progress a game if you're not willing to, like, look at ideas that other games have and adapt it to your own game. That's how you progress. Expecting a game to have 100% original ideas is absolutely asinine in the current day and age. You have people who are, like, passionate for games trying to suggest change, and you, you, you get shit on for it. But back in the day, like, you'd want those people to, like, suggest stuff. It's like, man, I wish you'd talk about these issues. But it, I think it's a casual audience. The casual audience, they, they think way too, high, uh, way too highly of themselves. Because it's the casuals who are telling, like, the good players to get good, which is fucking ridiculous. Which is crazy. I, I do I do think, I mean, that's an interesting take, too, right? Because, I mean, the, the casuals do, I think, their, their input has more weight. Yeah. Because there are more of them. So not only does it have more weight, but there are more people to support that view. And it, it does suck for somebody like us who are like, we're not even like the best players, but we're we're good players. So it's like we just get shafted. We're we're definitely in like the group of people who gets shafted the hardest. No, I think even if even if you're pro nowadays, folks don't give a shit. Like if you're a pro dude, well, if you're pro right now, like you're grinding ranked, bro, you're fucking killing it, dude. You're literally killing plats. Like oh, that too. You, you're having a time of your life. Like, if you're three stacking as pro players right now, you're living life, bro. Dropping 20 bro, bombs and quote unquote pred dudes, ranks. Yeah, as far as um, feedback goes and people taking you seriously, even if you're pro right now, the casual community doesn't give a shit what you have to say. You could be saying the right thing too. And it's like, we don't care. Like self revive getting removed. It's the most hilarious topic because people are like, self revive doesn't do anything. Nine times out of 10, it doesn't work. So, like, why remove it? Bitch, why not remove it? It doesn't work. According to your own emissions, it doesn't work. Respawn just listens to pros and it's just catered around like all anything that pros say or whatever. And he was just like, Nox was just fucking with him. He's just like, yeah, you're right. You know what? Here, I got this. Hey, Respawn, remove the wingman. And he's like, hopefully that hopefully that comes into effect in like the next week or two. <laughs> just fucking trolling around like it's these kids. It's just like, you know, that that kid, that thought is not his own. Oh, no. He saw that on it like never some TikTok is. or some shit. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're like, that they're like a hive mind. They're, they're drones. Everyone repeats the same thing. And to some degree, it can be funny in some cases. But now, like, and the worst part is people use that like, oh, they're just joking to like hide folks who actually mean what they're saying, which nowadays is the majority of people who say these things in certain regards. But people would say like, like I said, bro, skill issue, L take, all this stuff because they don't have their own thoughts. It's so easy to say, like, to, like, basically discredit someone by saying two, two words than it is to, like, actually say why you don't think that they're correct. And everyone says the exact same thing. Get good. Like, they'll just say, like, if you can't do this or that, then, like, you know, just get better. It's, 
absolutely ridiculous. They're all just repeating the same thing that they always hear because it's, it's like the things that they've been told and the things that they read on post. Critical thoughts out the window because it's way harder to like think critically than it is to just repeat what you hear and become a drone. And these folks are drones. Ain't nobody critically thinking these days. They don't. <laughs> and it's like, it's a video game. It's so easy to be like, huh, my teammates leave the game. Why? Oh, that's why. Okay, cool. But they don't even do that shit. They're just like, get better, bro. Prevent your teammates from leaving the game. Stop your enemies from leaving the game. It's like, how, bro? But they don't, even think, they don't think that far. They just think like, I have a hard time getting wins. Like, what the fuck, bro? 18% win rate over 10k games. I don't even go for wins. That's the, that's the hilarious part. They probably have like a 1% win rate.